Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to Say Bo Say A Lot, where you'll find sensational attributes beyond the obvious. Did you stop by to subscribe? Thank you, because I need you. This is the relaunch of our channel, and your support means a lot to me. When I say our channel, I mean my viewers and mine. Your comments are always welcome, along with future ideals for videos. What is the channel about? Mainly a lifestyle and mental, emotional, and physical health. Food and eating healthy by growing what you eat. So today let's just enjoy some mental health by getting some inspiration. Love is all around us. We just need to open our eyes and look at the small things. Realize that love is not only found in another human person, but also in nature, animals, and in the creation of our own hands. It is of my opinion that everyone has the same purpose. Just in case you were wondering what yours was, I did for a long time. And then I found that it is to bring value and perseverance to the earth and humankind while promoting love, peace, joy, and unity. Using whatever is inside of you that gives you satisfaction to impart to the world. And that would be the first thing that came to mind after hearing this statement, in most cases. Try to allow someone to change when they have changed. And do not be so harsh always to hold people to their past. Allow healing and you may find that you will also receive healing. I see you. You are not invisible. You are important. You have value. You are special. You have a purpose. So leave your first name, your nickname, or initials in the comments section. I want to know my community. So keep in mind, if you're going into or coming out of a store, it's okay to smile and hold the door for another person and say hi or how are you doing today? And if someone holds the door for you, it's okay to smile and say thank you. Have a nice day. Each day, say and think of three things that you are grateful for so that your life might flow like the rivers of waters that bring forth fruit of life each day. Choices. You have a choice to think on negative or positive thoughts. So I encourage you to think on positive. The Book of Knowledge teaches us in Philippians 4, 8 to think on whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, Whatsoever things are lovely, and whatsoever things are of a good report. If there be any virtue, and if there be any praise, think on these things. 
This is important. Be sure to watch these three gates of your face. Your eye gate. Eliminate watching any filthiness with your eyes, like pornography or brutal acts. Some movies are really going a bit far these days. Number two, your ear gate. Eliminate hearing a lot of filthy and hateful speech. Words that promote fear and not just awareness. Number three, your mouth gate. Saying curse words are not cool. Speaking negative words, especially about yourself or your circumstances, is a big no-no. Stay away from gossip and negativity of others. Try to edify or build up with your words by speaking positive things over another person or just leave it alone. Because who is perfect? No, not one of us. And it's easy to get sucked into negative conversation. I'm guilty and plead forgiveness and correct myself to be aware of this fault. I too am a work in progress. Today is the best day of my life. Subscribe, and that will warm my heart. Plus, I have special gifts planned for my subscribers. Like the video, and that will give me some motivation. Leave a comment, and I will blow you a verse, virtual kiss. Thank you for all and any support. Thanks for stopping by. See you next week. Love, peace, and prayer.